The Pokemon Company pushes out multiple spin-off games from the main series ones quite often, with one of their most recent spin-off games being a mobile game called Pokemon Masters EX. While that game is well known throughout the community, for better or for worse, there's another game that released that I feel is sort of unrepresented in the Pokemon community, that being Pokemon Unite. Much like Masters EX, this is a spin-off game from the mainline games, pretty much involving nothing like capturing or IV and EV training or even shiny hunting, but instead is more of a MOBA-like game. I had started playing it about half a year after it released and I was not ready for how much I was going to enjoy and absolutely loathe this game. Before getting to all that though, I want to answer some basic questions about the game. Why did it take me so long to hear about it? What makes it such a great competitive game? Why is this game so important for Pokemon in general? Starting with the first question, I think the simplest answer is that when you've grown up only knowing Pokemon for the mainline games, the spin-off games are a lot harder to sink your teeth into, at least for me. I'd write them off as not really being the experience I was looking for or maybe just kind of being a cash grab, and to some extent, me thinking that is fine. Why should I try to enjoy a game that I know I won't really enjoy? In my experience, it just makes playing the game harder. But Unite isn't one of those games, and besides it having a concurrent player base of almost 1.6 million players, it shows that off with its competitiveness. My second question was what makes the game so good from a competitive standpoint, and I can honestly say that the answer to that question is accessibility. While this game is on the Switch, it is also readily available on most mobile devices, meaning any 8 year old who can play iPad Fortnite can now play Unite. I know what you're thinking now. Get on Unite and absolutely dunk on children until you get to the master rank. I know what kind of man you are. Because I was that person. I too thought that because this was a mobile game for a primarily younger audience, I would absolutely destroy any team I was placed against. Boy was I wrong. It's not children on this game. I repeat, it is not children on this game. You might run into the occasional young lad gaming, but most of the times in ranked, you are running against real people who will abuse any build that Mr. YouTuber man or Redditor shits out into the world. That being said, it's very easy to get a good build for any character you choose to play as, and every character has its place on a team. I would say that most Pokemon here are balanced, with the exception of a few when they were first released or maybe they're going through changes, but even then, the game is getting consistently updated and balanced. And the best part is, every character that they have in the game, you can either choose to use your real life money to buy them, or you can just use the in-game currency you earn while playing to buy them. So, there's nothing really locked behind a paywall. If you see a very unbalanced guy that you would like to abuse while he's, you know, in need of a nerf, then you could just, you know, buy him and use him, and probably farm back all the coins that you already spent to buy him. The game's accessibility and overall balance makes it an enjoyable competitive experience, leaving me to actually say that was a great game when I lose instead of wishing the worst upon my enemies after the match. Like I said before, when Unite first released, I was very quick to push it off. Looking back, I wish I had given it a chance sooner because Unite has just the right amount of mainline games mixed in with the spinoff for me. It's crazy fun to get into even if I don't have a group of friends there, but some of the most fun I've had on this game is when I'm with my friends. Having a 5 man wrecking crew is just something else. Not only that, but playing this game in a LAN setting is so so much fun. Being in the same room as the team I'm playing with, my buddies, my friends, and we're all in the same game, it makes me feel like, I don't know, so old school. I feel like I'm back in the 90s when like gaming was just starting to, I don't want to say take off, but find its form. Overall, the game is great, and if you haven't already, you should definitely try it. I think it's done a lot for the Pokemon franchise, and I don't see it dying anytime soon. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, sub, tell me I sound handsome, do whatever makes you happy. My name's Poet, I'll see you guys next time.